Thanks, Beatrice, and good morning, everybody. Thank you for joining us today. As you're all aware, today we're just going to quickly go through accelerating your growth with Barracuda MSP services, and we're going to take a particular particular focus on some of our fully managed services that we offer. It's a product that we don't speak much about, but I'm sure hopefully you'll all get something out of it today. And if you have any questions, as Beatrice said, feel free to put them into the, the message bar and we'll get to them at the end of the webinar today. So what's in store for the next 30 minutes? We're going to take a little bit of time to talk about the challenges of growing an MSP. And then we're going to obviously hand over and show you how Barracuda MSP can help you. And then at the end, as per usual, we'll show you some resources and answer any questions you may have that have come up from today's presentation. Growing an MSP, we know it's hard. It's hard for you to find new staff. It's hard to find new customers. And it's really hard to keep abreast of the emerging technology that's needed to help protect our customers from the ever evolving threats that we're seeing. As we mentioned on the previous slide, there are many challenges facing you, the MSP, and we don't have time for them today to cover all of them, but I'm sure that you'll agree that at one point of time, you'll see some of these throughout your own business at any given point of time. You know, one of the biggest challenges we see is security, especially at the moment. You know, you've got to keep up with the required, you've got to keep abreast of the new technology and the new threat vectors. You need to help protect your customers as they're going through the digital transformation over the past 12 months. I'm sure many of you have seen many changes in the way your customers are, your customers are set up. And we've obviously all seen that the, the edge of the network has expanded with people working from home, from still from the office, or working from anywhere. You know, obviously the other side of the breast, uh, the other problems we have are staffing. I hear there's many challenges out there at the moment in the MSP space. Many of you are looking for new staff, have growing MSP enterprises, and it's getting very, very hard. There is a talent drain at the moment. You know, staff are, are wanting to be you know, kept up to breast with the latest technology. And we feel that with by offering the Barracuda services and our training methods, that's another method you can help keep those staff stay. They like to be working with the latest technology. And obviously the expertise. Not only are you out there supporting your current customers while also out there trying to grow your customers through organic or expansion, you need to be able to stay abreast of the latest technologies. And it's really challenging at the moment, especially with all the emerging threats that we're seeing, as we mentioned before. So the first thing I want to show you guys is perhaps the portfolio. Now, we always revert to this to show you guys of all the various different products we have available, but I want you all to hone in a little bit on the smaller writing we have underneath the services we have listed. They are the various different flavors in which those services become a that we offer those services to the MSP channel. And one that we probably haven't touched on enough is the FMS or the fully managed service. And today we're gonna to cover that off a bit more to give you a better idea about what's involved and you know, how we can help you grow your revenue. As I mentioned, we're gonna focus in on the products that we offer a fully managed service around. And today, these are the products that we have a fully managed service built, ready to go. You can order it today and have it delivered and supplied tomorrow. So the first product we're going to talk about is Barracuda's managed fish line. I'm sure many of you have seen this product before. The key thing about this product is it's a fully managed solution that we offer to you, the MSP. There's no need for you to go out and build campaigns, build those emails that you need to send out to your customers. We do that all for you. And basically, we've we have that all ready to go roll out in various campaigns to your customers as needed. The great thing about Barracuda Managed Fish Line is it will help your customers meet their compliance requirements. And it also trains their staff to be on the lookout for those emails that come through that may be harboring you know, bad intentions or malware or threats towards the company. The next product I wanna talk a little bit about is the Barracuda Cloud Gen Firewall. We assist here with the full implementation of the firewall. So you and your staff can have no experience in firewall management or maintenance at any given point of time. We'll join you on the call with the customer in the initial setup, where we'll work out the configuration required and we'll send the box out, already preloaded with the configuration, ready to plug in, ready to go. So it makes it very easy for you to be able to implement and do it. And we also handle the 24 by seven security event monitoring and remediation for that device. So 
you can know and be confident in the knowledge that you're deploying a CloudGen firewall with up-to-date settings and the product is being managed and you, you and your team can focus on the business that they need to get to without having to focus on managing that firewall. We also have Barracuda's managed backup appliances. You know, they offer a comprehensive cloud integrated business disaster recovery solution. And as I mentioned, we offer 24 by seven with 365 monitoring and remediation on that service as well. Not to mention also in that backup portfolio, we do have our Barracuda managed IBU in Tronus Backup, which is a software based solution. And it integrates with top RMM and PSA tools, including Barracuda's RMM tool and allows you to monitor and remediate via the RMM, meaning that you can give your customers a one-on-one -on -one white glove experience while monitoring the solution remotely and giving them a fully managed solution. And last but not least, obviously as a component of our Barracuda remote monitoring and management tool, we do have network operations center and a help desk service available. You will see some expansion in this. As you may have heard, we've recently entered into an agreement with Skyber Security, which will give us further XDR capabilities in this space. So just to give you guys a little bit of an idea, um, these are the types of emails that we'll use to engage with your partners if you're looking at the managed fish line solution. So we focus very much on not just providing emails where we're targeting them with traditional sort of clicks, but also trying to trick them into handing over their Windows detail, uh, their Windows logins. Um, you'll notice there that this one here highlights the failed attempts to log into a workstation and advises uh, the end user that their account's in jeopardy. By clicking on the link, we're asking them to verify their account details. So generally what we're doing is taking them away to a various website and asking them to enter their Office 365 or their login account details. You know, which we'll then we'll further report on and send back to you to advise that they've actually been fished. You know, as you can see here, here's another attack that we've we've got as part of our uh, part of our program, and this one here informs them that they've exceeded their mailbox quota and no longer will be able to receive email unless they contact IT to get their um, current mailbox size. And lastly, but not leastly. Um, this one here also is an analytics report, which we use. Now, the surprising thing is, is we are finding that these are getting through and customers are clicking on them. We run this service with quite a few customers in Australia. And I guess the key thing that we are finding is we're not targeting emails around your traditional, you know, your food, beverage, those sorts of things. We're targeting more what we expect our customers to be able to click. And the whole idea of this is tricking the customer into actually clicking on the link from that point in which we can then feed that information back to you via the reporting that we make available. So just to give you guys an idea, when we onboard any new partner into our program, we actually enter them into our internal system to be able to process this. And part of the key things that we do focus on is giving you guys detailed reports at the end of each month. Um, obviously you guys aren't running the service. So we're feeding this information back. And this information comes out at the end of each 30 day period and is fully white labelable, uh, fully able to be white labelled. So you can actually pass this information back to your customers. It covers a lot of the key information, such as the send date of the campaign. One thing to note with us is we will not target the organisation all on one day. We will do it throughout that month period um, in order to stop people from being able to point out that the email has come through. And generally we use up to three to four different emails within each organisation to try and avoid you know, somebody clicking on it and then going around and informing the rest of the staff in the office about it. As you can see, we've got detailed information about what was actually sent out to them, where the information was sent, the send date and times, whether there was a quick, uh, whether they've clicked on the link to actually view it, if there's been any images downloaded, if the customer was out of the office, if they replied to the email at any given point of time. And obviously we also show if they've attended any of the training completed, or even if they've passed any of that training that we've offered to them. I think the key thing to remember, and it's something that we're seeing more and more people after, is managed email security awareness helps you discover your customers' vulnerabilities. You know, there's many regulations out there at the moment that we're starting to see come through. Like in the US, they talk about HIPAA, FINRA, and the PCI DSS. And we're starting to see some of them regulations moving towards 
the Australian market. In the US, many businesses are required to provide security awareness training to their employees, and this service makes it easy for them to help them to meet that requirement. You know, we provide robust reporting for the various campaigns, and we feel that they can help you identify the levels of risk within your customers' organisations. And as I mentioned, the best part about it all is we manage everything for you. We will set up all the campaigns each month and send you regular reports to keep you updated with the status of them. All you need to do is provide us with a list of email addresses and names. As I mentioned earlier, we also do have a managed firewall solution. This is a great solution for customers who might not have the overhead or the technical expertise to be able to offer a managed firewall solution, or maybe are just a bit shy in offering a solution to their customers as they feel that they don't you know, have, the, have the ability to be able to offer and support the product. One of the key components that we offer is we offer 24 by seven network security. So 24 by seven support and monitoring on these endpoints. We also offer on the spot remediation. So if we see something affecting that firewall, we will actually remediate it then and there, avoiding downtime for you and your customer. And it's a very simple and easy onboarding. As I mentioned, we will meet with you and the customer. We'll arrange a phone call where we will discuss the, you know, the requirements for the solution. And then we'll spend that time working with you and the customer to get that solution, um, to get that configuration sorted out. Once we've got that configuration um, supplied, we'll then ship the firewall with that configuration loaded, meaning that all you need to do is go out on site, plug it in, and then work with your customer to get them up and going and using the product that they need. I guess the great thing from this is there's no investment from your team. And one of the great things that we do offer is we do have a really good Barracuda campus where if your team did wish to undertake the training, there's small bite-sized training available. And when your team does become proficient, it could be maybe that you'll take that fully managed service back and look after it yourself. So we'll talk a little bit about managed backup. So it's available as either an all-in-one physical appliance, or we do have a virtual solution available to MSPs who are wanting to leverage the, their existing storage and compute infrastructures that they may already have deployed. So what we mean by that is if you already have some NASs or storage service deployed, we do have a solution that can take advantage of those, meaning that hardware is no longer redundant and still offer you a cloud-based backup or BDR solution for you and your customers. It's a really flexible solution. It protects a variety of IT and applications environments. Barracuda Backup supports multiple OS systems, hypervisors, on-premise-based applications and cloud environments. It's a powerful backup solution, which includes all the hardware, software, and the agents required. You know, obviously you can supply redundant storage if needed to service a variety of different backup and disaster recovery requirements that you may have. One of the great things about the Barracuda backup solution is we can replicate customer data securely and efficiently from an on-premise physical or virtual backup appliance to the Barracuda cloud, a remote physical appliance, a remote virtual appliance, or even store that data in AWS if that's where you'd like to have it stored. We offer next business day shipping on all hardware replacements for these products and a hardware refresh every four years to, to ensure that the hardware is up to, up to scratch and also to ensure minimum downtime with any failures. And as I mentioned, as part of the Barracuda RMM suite, which is our our remote management and monitoring solution. We do have Barracuda RMM NOC and Barracuda RMM Help Desk. Both those bottom two products are great solutions for MSPs just starting out or looking to grow their MSP business. Um, the RMM NOC comes in three various different flavors with us able to offer the ability to just remit to report. So if we monitor your sites and then we see any you know, challenges within an organization, we can report those back to you via tickets. So you can easily go out and do that remediation work that's required or that reactive work. We also have a second layer where we'll actually do some of the remediation and the reporting for you. Meaning you don't even need to be available awake or even in your office and your customers will be taken care of. Um, and then we have the third option which offers much more higher level of remediation and involves some project work, project planning and those sorts of things. Um, so they're, 
three various different flavors. And where we feel this really fits is we see many customers winning 24 by seven contracts and may not have 24 by seven practices themselves. We make a great addition to their team by adding the knock and the remote help desk services. And it can enable them to be able to offer those 24 by seven services to their customers without any major you know, investments from you on your side by employing new staff or you know, requiring to keep your office open 24 by seven to be able to offer those support to two customers. We also do see in the past that some customers have walked away from opportunities that have involved 24 by seven, knowing that they can't support that. This is a great way to be able to offer those offer services to be able to support those customers. And they would see the Barracuda RMM NOC team as just an extension of your normal IT practice. You know, as I mentioned, we offer around the clock network and user support. There's proactive monitoring and management. We have options that include remediation and management as well. And obviously with the RMM help desk product, we do offer that third layer where we can offer end user support, you know, answering those quick questions about office, setting up signatures, um, setting up new users on the network, um, traditional services that you do inside your own organization. You know, we take the heavy lifting away from you so you can go in and focus on the rest of your business or realistically other projects that you may be involved in. So I guess the key thing about the MSP partner services team that we employ that looks after those NOC services is they have very deep technical expertise and we operate them as part of, you know, Barricade operates as part of the MSP. So when your customers phone our NOC and help desk services, we'll answer it as your business name. You know, it reduces the time for you to go to market. You know, if you have a 24 by seven opportunity and you need to increase your staffing to cover that, it could take three to four weeks to get that staff in onboarding and get them ready and up and going. We can get this service spun up in less than a week. Um, and just recently we run a really good opportunity with a client who had 17 staff members. So his end user customer had 17 staff members located all around Northern Territory and Western Australia located in remote communities. And we've been able to actually offer them 24 by seven support so we actually monitor all their machines to ensure that there's no problems with those machines for those remote staff members. We also provide the remediation. So in the event they get a virus or something along those lines, we're able to remediate that without you know, affecting you, the MSP, and get that all cleaned up for them. And the last thing that we're able to offer was the, the actual 24 by seven help desk support that they needed. With these staff members, obviously in remote communities and in regional Australia, they don't operate in standard Australian business hours. So they wanted their staff to be able to get support when they needed it. And we were able to fulfill that need for that customer. The MSP that closed that opportunity only has two staff in Australia. So we've actually allowed them to expand their offering and services without actually having to grow their business. Um, and the key thing that he pointed out to me is that it's become something that they no longer need to worry about. They're seeing tickets raised, they're seeing the tickets actually closed and the customers reported back that the actual support's been outstanding. So if you're in that situation or have those opportunities, don't hesitate to reach out to us. We can assist and we can help you grow your business, appear bigger and offer that 24 by seven support if you don't already offer that to your customers. I guess one of the key things is, is we feel we make it really easy for you to adopt these services. You know, we have simple onboarding with all services. You know, as I mentioned, we have calls with you and your team to work out the modes of contact and escalation points. There's a little bit of paperwork to work through, but we feel that that gives us the best solution at the end of the day of being able to support you and your customer and gives us an understanding of what your requirements are. You know, we provide brandable white label reporting which you can use to feed information to your customers about what you're doing to protect their business and allows you to show the value of the services that you're adding to their business as well. And lastly, and not leastly, don't forget about the ease of billing. You'll know exactly how much these services will cost for the duration of the agreement with the customer with no hidden costs. They're simple monthly charges based off end users. So very simple to price up and, you know, a great way of knowing that you've got a fixed cost for the duration of the contract. We all know how competitive some of these opportunities can get out there at the moment.
So just to reiterate, you know, we're here to help. You know, we can help you add service offerings without needing to add resources, staffing to be able to cover them. We can help you reduce the administrative overhead. We'll take care of a lot of the work that's required, you know, the ticketing, the simple tasks, allowing you to focus on what's important to your business and your growth. And obviously with that, we can help you drive your monthly reoccurring revenue and profitability. If you're able to assist more customers in various different ways, um, obviously there's the ability for you to have more services. The other thing to remember as well is that 24 by seven contracts can be quite lucrative. Um, and normally it's been the inability for us to be able to have the staffing levels to be met that has you know, stopped some of us from working in those opportunities. And it's definitely a space that we're seeing more and more opportunities as customers have moved to the cloud in the last 18 months and are expecting their businesses to be running 24 by seven, 365 days of the year. So I guess the key thing we want to talk to you about is if you have held off in the past offering services to customers as you haven't got the in-house technical expertise or the bandwidth to support the solutions, let us at Barracuda MSP assist you with the service offerings to help there. Don't forget, as I mentioned earlier, we have some great resources in the Barracuda campus that offer small 10 to 15 minute modules of training that can allow you and your team to grow their technical knowledge. So whilst you might start with us with a fully managed service, as your knowledge grows and your team attain, attain various different levels of qualification, you may decide to take that service back in house, meaning that obviously you can pick up additional revenue for you and your business. I guess what we're trying to do is simplify the process for you and you know, really reiterate that you should be out there growing your business, acquiring new customers, not worried about how you need to roll out all these new services all the time. The other thing is, is if you would like to book a demo and learn more about some of these services, there is a link there that you can use, which will book a demo with Matt Caffrey, our sales engineer. Um, he'd be more than happy to go through and explain how a fully managed service can assist and go through the process to give you further details so you feel more confident and comfortable with offering the solution to your customers. As always, you can reach out to myself. I see some familiar faces within the attendees today. So if you've got any questions, don't hesitate to give me a call. More than happy to explain how we do it what we can do and you know what levels we can help support your customers with. And as per usual, we never end without showing you some resources to help you grow your business. So obviously we have the, you know, these resources are all available. They're all free. They do have a certain Barracuda spin to them. Um, I guess the key thing is, is these are all resources designed for MSPs. They go through very important information. You know, obviously the MSP resources at the top has sales, marketing and business resources. We have the Barracuda Security Insights. As some of you may be aware, this is the, this is the module that feeds all the information into our products and keeps us aware of all the various different threats out there on the market. It runs in real time and can show you the various threats that we're seeing through our products at any given point of time or in the last or previous 24 hours. And last one is Smarter MSP. I would definitely recommend if you aren't a member of Smarter SP to join it. It's got some really good information about how to smarten and in, you know, improve your organisation. And we, got, we get a lot of industry experts in who are happy to discuss various different topics, which you can you know, obviously glean a little bit of information about and then use internally in your own organisation. And I guess on that note, I just want to check if anybody had any questions on anything we may have covered today. Great. Thank you, Luke, for showing us the range of Barracuda MSP fully managed services. Now let's scroll through the questions from our audience. Luke, are you ready? Sure. Cool. Awesome. Great. Let me just start. So the first question is from Anthony. For the end user training, how often does it get new content? So with the with the Manage Fishline Edge user training, we currently have a process at the moment where we divide we divide our campaigns into three months. So for the first month, we really target, you know, supplying information about phishing threats and that sort of information into that customer base in order to give them a level of education. In the second month, we'll actually start the initial phishing simulation and testing process. From this, we hope to derive the information that we need on who clicks on those emails, who deletes the emails, and basically we collate all that information in that second month. The third month, we then focus on re-educating those customers again, and also re-phishing 
the first group of people who have failed the first phishing test. In relation to the actual templates that we use for that, they're constantly evolving and we find that they're changing quite often depending upon what we're seeing out there coming in. So those ones that I've currently shown you may still be in use. They were from about three or four months or they may have evolved into something more recently. So we endeavor to keep up with that. We do do fish line training for over 1500 people worldwide. So 1500 MSPs use our service worldwide. So as you can imagine, we get a lot of feedback and we're more than you know, open to receiving more feedback from customers in that space as well. Thank you, Luke. I'm just gonna group the question with the product. So we've got another question for fish line. Which level of exam do we need to give for fish line in order to handle everything else? Yeah, Barani, we do have a solution available with Fishline. If you are looking for a solution in order to handle everything with yourself, we would need to possibly speak to the Barracuda Networks team. So what I would recommend is I'll give you a call after this and a follow up with that, but we do have a solution available. It's just not offered through the MSP channel. Primarily, we've found that most of our customers are looking for a solution that they don't have to invest a lot of time in. It's the biggest catch with phishing software. You can spend a lot of time building campaigns, but it all comes down to whether you'll be able to make a return. Yeah, thank you, Luke. And the next few questions are about our backup solutions. So Ben is asking, can you white label the backup solution? We, in the backup solutions, we have two. We have the Barracuda BBS, and we also have Barracuda Intronus. Barracuda BBS at the moment, which is an appliance-based solution, cannot be white labeled, but we are working on that. But our Barracuda Introna solution, our cloud-based solution is fully white label and ready to be delivered to the market today. Great, thank you. And another question about backup as well. Um, so Eric from Eric, um, do you offer backup solution for Microsoft Office 365? Uh, yes, Eric, we do have a solution for Office 365. That would be our Barracuda Cloud to Cloud Backup, part of our essential suite of products. If you'd like to leave your number, I'm more than happy to give you a call after this to discuss that further with you. Yeah, awesome. And I just want to add that um, we'll be doing a deep dive into our backup solution in our next webinar. I'll share the details in the next slide. Yeah. Uh, Peter, <laughs> just got a message from Peter. I can yeah. help with pricing. I'll follow up with you after this meeting, if that's okay, Peter. Great, thank you, Luke. You're one step ahead of me. <laughs> and another, so we've got a question from Darren. So are the knock and help desk part of a Barracuda RMM? Are the knock and the help desk are additional services to Barracuda RMM. So Barracuda RMM out of the box will provide you with your remote management and monitoring. And then we have a couple of various different add-ons we can add depending upon what your requirements are. They don't have to be added across your whole customer base. We can deploy these on a site-by-site -site requirement, which is probably one of the key things to remember as well is that you don't need to have every customer using these services. You can have the customers only using these services who require them. On, a, on top of the NOC services, we offer a managed antivirus solution. We have a third-party patching software. So we can, not only do we do our Windows patching standard, but we can also offer you the ability to do third-party patching across up to 2,000 various different applications on the network. Yeah. Um, the NOC and the help desk, as I mentioned, are additional add-on services. And we even have a bundle that includes both some of our traditional NOC services and the help desk services together to try and bring that price down to make it easier for you to sell. Thank you, Luke. Question from Patrick. Do you see a lot of your partners using all of these fully managed services from Broker MSP? Um, it really comes down to the customers. So we have some fully managed firewalls out there at the moment with a couple of customers who have just entered into that space. They've never used a firewall before and they're currently utilizing us to do that. At the same time, their technicians are currently undergoing our Barracuda training from Barracuda campus. So they're looking and hoping to be able to take that product and service on themselves in the future. It really comes down to the solution and the requirements. We also work with a large grocer through Barracuda where we actually provide the fully managed service and management for them where they will need a 24 by seven operation and the MSP wasn't able to offer that service to them. So they've outsourced the management of the firewalls to us and we take care of that service for the customer. Great, thank you. Question from Mark, what is your onboarding process? 
Very, very simple. So depending upon the product, there are various different steps and levels. We work very you know, easily with MSPs. I think the key thing to note is, you know, general products within us are very quick to be onboarded. Agreements are signed within 48 hours. Licenses are available. With the NOC services, it is a bit more of a detailed onboarding session where you'll actually sit down and meet with a Barracuda representative and we'll actually give you some paperwork where we actually need to sit down and work out things like escalation points, you know, ticketing systems, phone numbers, how you want the phone answered, et cetera, et cetera. So, I've been told by partners it's not as intrusive or as long as some of the others, and they've found it really easily. It's quite an easy process to work through. Great. Thank you, Luke. And last question from Timmy. Where can I see demo of some of these products? Um, as I mentioned earlier, you can book a demo directly with Matt. You can also reach out to any of us within Barracuda MSP. And let me just get some details up. There's our contact details, and we're more than happy to help you facilitate that demo. Drop me a quick email, give me a quick buzz on a phone. I'll get the link sent through so you can book that time with Matt, and we'll get that covered off so you can sit down, view the product, and get an idea about how it works. Awesome. Thank you, Luke. So that was the last question. So thank you, everyone, for all your questions. And Luke, can you jump on to the next slide? Oh, sorry. Yeah, yep. there you go. Good job. <laughs> so just before we go, um, we've got our next webinar, which is on the 22nd of July. So we'll be showing you our Zero Trust Network SS services, take a deep dive into our backup solutions, as I mentioned just before. And we'll also take you through our free sales to Barracuda email practice scanner. So if you would like to sign up, the link is on the screen or you can opt in at the survey. And we hope you enjoyed this webinar. A reminder, please spare a minute or two to take the survey. It should pop up once you exit the webinar. So on that note, have a great day, everyone. Thank you, Luke, and see you next time.